what's going on guys i don't know what the last couple things i've i filmed it's been a couple weeks uh i did go to san diego for work within that time but we are here in my new house so i guess this video will be i guess a little bit of a walkthrough and then i should have picked up the camera yesterday but i've been slowly working at the g35 ended up fixing it and we're planning to take it drifting next weekend which is the 18th um so yeah the other thing that kind of sucks right now is I don't have internet, so I haven't really been able to upload videos and stuff, but the room we are currently sitting in is what will be, I guess, the man cave slash my office. So, yeah, my computer, all my nerd shit. Gonna get a TV for there and another couch. Um, we'll save the garage for last, but empty bedroom, bathroom, so upstairs, yeah, so this is my new base of operations. Got the living room. I kind of just moved in, so all my stuff is like everywhere, but yeah, living room, couches, TV. Actually got a dining room now. Um, kitchen, and then Going back here, oh, there's a bathroom, empty bedroom, empty bedroom, and then my room, which is the master. Yeah. Like I said, don't worry, or uh, don't mind the mess, kind of just moved in and still getting unpacked, situated. Um, don't know what the hell is all over the floor here. But yeah, I think David just got back. Um, yeah, David's over helping me with the G. But yeah, um, and here's, hold out the camera. There's David. Um, yeah, in the middle of doing coilovers on the G. Just over halfway done pulling stuff out, but yeah. Got another freezer, all this crap. I need to clean through all this so we can get the crest setup pulled in. But yeah, we got a two car garage. There's the old Cressida still leaking oil everywhere. But yeah, there's a little walk through the house. I'll go ahead and put this down and David and I can get back to work. So yeah. All right, don't mind me for getting to film. Um, we got this side pretty much done. Um, this is way too low. Don't mind the gap, I need spacers, but yeah. Rear fitment, not bad. Damn it's, not right, it's not jacked up. David's uh, starting on this side. I might go get my keys so I can, actually I should not do that because we got to hook up the other side. But yeah, coils are going in. Uh, waiting on a Aaron to text me so we can get the diff welded. Um, yeah. David, thoughts on uh, potentially having this done by the end of today? I'm pretty confident we will. Yeah. Coil over's in, then we adjust ride height. Uh, the diff welded, diff put back in, do an oil change, and. Right, the diff part, that's, that's another story, but the coilovers definitely going to be done today. No, depending on how long Aaron takes to um, weld it, we can have this ready to go. And then uh, go find a parking lot because it's raining so we can hit do some... Uh... Oh, you mean like down in Mexico? Yeah, New Mexico run. Yeah, Got to test, uh, yeah. test out the new diff. New diff, coilovers. This thing's probably going to be way too low, but whatever. Yeah, hopefully, uh, yeah, back on uh, car content. What if we just say Canada? Because it is like, you know, an hour north. Yeah, but I don't know what the rules in Canada are. I don't know either, but I'm not So saying, saying Canada could still be illegal. Dave, what are you doing? What are you hammering? What do you think I'm hammering on? I don't know. Oh, the, the, the thing I had yeah, the, 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 
Yeah, the coilover is way too tight. Potentially seized. Hey, Never great. mind, David got it. Um, but yeah, we're gonna get back to work. All right, coilovers are on. Gonna do a fitment test and uh, see if she's too low or not. Hopefully we don't put it down on stuff in the back, but yeah. Um, and then I did get some new wheels. These are on Koenig Hypergrams, I think, or something like that, on some Yokohama Advans. Advans, David. Um, so these are gonna be my steers and drive home tires. And then we'll burn off uh, the old discount tire specials. Yeah, no, the side skirt kind of covers it. Also, you're going pretty far. I, I would go right where the door seam is between the two doors. I didn't want to, you know, ruin your side skirts here, but... No, you just go far enough in. You can hit it. No, no more. How is it? Oh, I guess you were on it. Yeah. Fuck it. Moment of truth. Honestly, David, that... That rear is high as fuck. Well, we'll see, because we're also at an angle. It might change. Um... Well, if this is perfect in the front, we still need to go back up because the um, the locking collar is not tight. Well, and your oil can. And the diff. Hopefully we got lucky. Yeah. Do an oil change, wait for... It's all nothing. Fuck it. Wait for uh, Aaron to get back to me on the diff. This thing needs a wash also. All the cars need a wash. Cressida needs another mirror. All right, let's see. Let's see if she's too low. Jesus, David. Also, I have settle out, but yeah. So bring up the front. The front. The front's definitely too low. Go like, how how much do you thinking to drop the the rear? I think bring the front Probably up. about. Bring the front like a half inch. Yeah. Bring the rear down a half inch. I would say a half inch. Yeah. Just do, a, do do the circle, do the full circle, like when the threads fully past the circle. That should be about a half inch, roughly. I, I don't know what they're at at the front, so. Wow, well, I know where they are in the rear, yeah. so I can do that. You got the front, so. Well, it's uh. I care about me, not you. It's all about me here. You know what? Oh, okay, the e-brake is up. I was like, how is this thing not fucking rolling? All right, well, we're gonna get this thing back up in the air and uh, do some adjustments. All right, got the oil changed. Uh, ride height made, final adjustments were made. These are gonna be my drive home wheels. So these are what, what are going on. We're burning these. Um, yeah, we're kind of at a stopping point with this until we get the diff back from Aaron which hopefully will be later tonight, hopefully, but... And then some skates from Mexico. Yeah. And then David wants to go to Mexico, so we're putting him on a flight tomorrow. 
Um, yeah, I don't even know where we're at with this video, but I might do some other things. I should get the garage the rest of the way organized so we can pull the Cressida in, but I still don't know where I'm gonna put everything. So, yeah. There's the update. David's getting wheels on. Um, oil's changed. We're just hanging out now at this point. So, yeah, we'll uh, I'll pick up the camera if we uh, if anything cool happens or if we figure out what we're doing. All right, so my OCD kicked in. We reorganized the garage, me and David, and. Got the, uh, the Cressida in here. So both cars are in the garage. If I could, yeah, there's David. Yep. Yeah. Yep. So both cars, driveway is free for me to buy more stuff. <laughs> just got the Corolla out here. So yeah, G is pretty much done. We're just waiting on the diff. And once that thing gets out of here, then we start tearing into this thing again. I know everyone's excited for that. No. I'm... I don't want to pull the motor again. Yeah, I don't know. I just want to drive this car because it's motor so good. Motor number four. You're not wrong. <laughs> Fourth time's a charm. Shit. What do we do now? Yeah, that, this is kind of all I had tasked for the weekend. So, um, got word from Aaron that uh, we won't be getting the diff back till probably tomorrow morning. So, the G will have to wait till tomorrow. We'll have to wait till tomorrow to finish putting the car together. And yeah. <clears throat> I technically could jack up the front of this and start draining fluids and pull the radiator and all that fun stuff. This is kind of in the way. This trash can is in the way. Everything in the way. If it's not one car, it's the other car. Let's see if I can get a better angle from over here. If that table wasn't there, you'd be able to see both cars perfectly fine, but yeah. Um, I don't think I filmed, but if you go back to my Instagram, like one of the last posts is almost that exact same picture, except the G wasn't in the air. And there wasn't a bunch of stuff in the garage, so. But yeah.